kids returning to school, we're reminded just how important a good education is. A Calgary woman has made it her life's work to ensure some of the poorest kids in Africa get a chance to go to school. Here's Daryl Jans. Wings of Hope for Africa is helping families in some of the poorest parts of Burundi and Rwanda break the cycle of poverty. Being from Africa, Aline Gaiza knows the needs. The reason why I studied Wings of Hope for Africa it was out of compassion for children in need. And also I realized like, it's no, at the end of the day, it's not what you have received or what you have or what you have accomplished. It's more what you can do for others. Aline believes education is the key to breaking the cycle of poverty. Every summer, Wings of Hope for Africa runs a back-to-school campaign to help the poorest kids go to school. Every fifty dollars can buy shoes, backpack, school supplies, uniform, and so those children can have the opportunity to go to school. Heather Kirby got involved as a volunteer. She's inspired by Aline's selflessness. The amount of her time and her energy that she pours into this. She's incredibly organized and well-connected in Burundi, so her, what might seem to her, her small effort is actually massive. Aline knows food is also very important. Wings of Hope started two community gardens where the people learn to grow their own food. They work together as a team, and at the end of the season, they will harvest like more than six ton tons of pareros, and then they will divide the harvest in two parts, one part to eat and another part to sell. For all she's doing through Wings of Hope for Africa to educate children and help families get out of poverty, Aline Gaiza is our inspired Albertan this week. Daryl Jans, CTV News, Calgary. If you have a story idea for Daryl, contact him by emailing inspired at bellmedia.ca.